Welcome to December 4th. Boy, this Palo Santo is on fire. And we're going to pull another rune today. And I'm going to sort of shake this up so it goes to smoke. There we go. And that's clearing the bag. And I am going to pull the rune for today, which is M for movement. The Palo Santo is really, is really strong, which is nice because that means it's really clearing. This yeah. rune from Ralph Blum's Book of Runes is really powerful. It's, um, it's called Ewaz, I believe, E-H-W-A-Z. And it is movement, progress. The most important part for this day, this December 4th, is that it is a rune that says you have progressed far enough to feel a measure of safety in your position. It is a time to turn again and face the future, reassured and prepared to share the good fortune that comes. The sharing is significant since it relates to the sun's power to foster light and illuminate all things with its light. So again, this is a key, a key rune to pull on our fourth day. This is a powerful rune because it's talking about accepting, accepting the power of movement and it's the opposite of being blocked. When we're blocked, we, I believe that we're in the dark, we're in the fear. Now dark is a wonderful thing because without the darkness, would we appreciate the light? That's always an interesting question. So with movement and progress, it indicates for us, those of us working from day one of December to day 21 of December toward the winter solstice, that it is a time to release, our, release any pain, release any suffering, release any negativity that we carry, even if it's a tiny bit. So hopefully you've been writing something down each day and you've been saying, I want to get rid of this. I want to focus on that. I want less of this. I want less angst in my life. I want less complaint. Um, and it's really an, it's an opportunity for us all to stay in our heart space and stay in a place of love and light. So December 4th is about paying attention to change. And from change, we know the cycle goes from one extreme to the other. So we're going from darkness as we approach the new light that's coming on December 21st. On the 21st, it's going to be the longest darkness here in the Northern Hemisphere. And that means that more light will be coming. Today, we're releasing the negative. We're identifying what is dark in our life because this is a perfect time to do it. Because the world, the planets, the planets are saying, there's, there, this is the time to recognize darkness, whether you like it or not. I'm hoping things are shifting a little bit for you and that you're moving more and more toward your personal light. I'm grateful you're with us on this journey with love, and I will see you on the 5th of December, which is tomorrow. And know that movement is happening because you're recognizing the darkness within and you are honoring the fact that there is a cycle and change is coming. So empowerment, empowerment, empowerment. Much love to you. I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks.